Alright. I'm starting another Strict Saving Draft Quandrix commands. Pretty good. Flash of Malice is good. Um I've seen Karov Wrangler be really good when it stays around, but I'd probably just take this Quandrix command because this card's pretty busted. You can play it. Just like add two counters and bounce a guy is pretty good. Like, the annul part isn't really super relevant. There's not, like, a ton of artifacts or enchantments people would play, but... Like, the shuffling target cards from their graveyard library doesn't happen a lot until, like, somebody's playing, like, Bookworm, then it matters, right? Yeah. You know, Chewy, how's it going? Yeah. Oh my god, do I just take this card? There's also an environmental sciences. Isn't this card stupid? Like, if you can actually cast it? It's like a 26-26 for 6. I mean, there is like a rise of excess in environmental sciences, but... I don't want to try out this card. I'll play 26-26. Devouring Tendrils. Ooh, boy. I'd like a Devouring Tendrils. Mage Hunter is funner, yeah. Take the Ultra Bomb, yeah. It's not amazing the limited. It's probably a meme, yeah. For sure. Or just take the Devouring Tendrils follow up. It's a good one. Sign in Blood's probably pretty good in Silver Quill because you just want all the card draw to like make up for your stuff. Not like a lot of big signs. Like, I don't really like Deadly Brew that much. You're definitely team environmental sciences, that's fair. Yeah, I know like Semulin was on like the first pick environmental sciences plan. Ugh. Maybe we're just running it back with the, uh, the Witherbloom. Because there's a, a, there's a Necrotic Fume. There's also Fractal Summoning, which is okay. It's like the Fractal Summoning, you know, just stay on target. I think Necrotic Fumes is pretty good, but I guess if we're doing Quandrix, like, Fractal Summoning is actually fine there, because we could cast, like, a 8-mana 6-6, six, six. right? I think Devouring Fumes is a sign, but... Or not ne Necrotic Fumes is a sign, but I'll take the Summoning. Let's see. Ooh, Compulsive Research, or Elemental Summoning. Or Mage Duel. Oh man, I think I wanted the Mage Duel, actually. Man. I think the problem I have, like, these Quandrix decks is just not having interaction. I, I, I like the Elemental Summoning, but I also like the Mage Duel a lot. Like, blue-green is a little light on, like, fight, like, interaction stuff. There's a little light on, like, interaction. Like, Mage Duel seems really good. To, like, not lose to, like, a stuff, like a Apprentice or something. Just Mage Duel it down. Just take the fight, yeah. I'm gonna take the fight spell. Uh, this is a lot of hunt for specimens. I think Zoomancy is, like, fine. It's it's Sam's preview card, yeah. I think this is like fine. It's not like amazing. Yeah, color and culling ritual, yeah. Like we can use it to kill our own body of research and fractal summoning. Just be like, I don't like you anymore. Get blown up. And so, I don't know. This is like the four three. You don't like it here, but yeah, it's fair. Uh, Eureka Moment or Anatomy. Hmm. Hey, thank you for the raid, Super Cesar, Sven, Foxes. Fox Sven. Hope you sing well, well. You like the Eureka Moment, yeah, or the Anatomy. I guess maybe Quandrix is a little open. These aren't, like, amazing Quandrix cards. But this is basically double, you like, whoa, best command, yeah. Vortex Runner is good, yeah. I think I kind of just take the Eureka moment. But I don't hate, like, the anatomy. Any learn cards? Kind of bad. 
Mm, Arcane Subtraction's not the worst, actually. Yeah, nice opposite draft cards. Yeah, it's not worth switching. You know, I think I take the Arcane Subtraction. It's just, like, fine. This also stops, like, Death Touch creatures. Or, like, you, like if your opponent blocks with a Death Touch creature, you just shrink it to a negative two or whatever, and it, like, gets around that. I think that Infuse of Vitality is good, but... I like the Arcane Subtraction is fun. Ooh, Karog Wrangler came back. Or Witherbloom Campus, or Elemental Masterpiece. This is really interesting. Is this card good? I think this card would be annoying. I don't know if it's good or not. You like Masterpiece? Yeah. I, I kind of want to try the Karog Wrangler, but I don't know. It's really interesting. All sorts of picks. I don't know. I'm going to try this card out, but it could be wrong. Okay, this is pretty awkward. Wrangle is good in green blue, yeah. Well, this doesn't really do a lot. I guess I'll. We're... Blue's been barely open this direction, but I guess we did that other draft where, like, green was, like, not open at all outside of, like, the dual cards, right? It's a big target for removal, yeah. Another bear, okay. Or do I want a two drop? I feel like there's better two drops in Wanderix. Am I crazy? You you like the Soothsayer Adept? Like the bear for the fight spells, yeah. More of this, okay. I might play this. It's hard to cast, though. But I think it's better than Spine Karok. I don't know. This might be hard to cast. Whatever. When is looting back? What? Boo! Boo! Earns. It's not Devouring Tendrils, I think. Yeah, Pledge Mage is a good thing the Devouring Tendrils off of. Right? I actually didn't mind, like, the, uh, the, the, whatever, the looter in Ikoria, but I understand it because, like, Mardu was, like, better than the green-blue. Green-blue is kind of bad in those colors. Yeah, this sucks passing that. But I'll take another Devouring Tendrils. It's a good card. And charge through for a 26-26 at some point, so I can get it later. Give me more Quandrix cards. What? Wait, why do you pass that card? Isn't this card good? I guess it's like a 5-mana 4-4 that makes them pay more for all their instants and sorceries. Isn't this card good? I'm just still going to take it. I mean, I would maybe take the Trickster also, but Eldrazi Gamers Unite. You know, yeah, this is a very Warren... Sorry, uh, very, uh, Kozilek-esque. For sure. That's like the... I've actually seen people cast the three mana spell side of that, which makes no sense. Ooh, Field Trip, yeah. I think I just want a Field Trip. I think it's a Field Trip. Passing their heated debate. Word. I feel like this is actually good in Quandrix, but we need the field trips first to make it really good. I mean, they got Mascot Exhibition, yeah. I actually heard of people getting, like, six-pick Mascot Exhibition. Oh, man. This just blocks forever. Kind of want to take the Drake, the block things, early. Just fill out the two-drop slot also a little bit. We don't have, like, a two-drop creature. We're, like, a little, like, a little lacking on two-drop creatures. It's going to block... Maybe this comes back too. I think I like taking a two drop. Team Panic can be interesting, but it's like a two drop. Breaker Shock, yeah. Uh. Doesn't really do anything, man. Doesn't really do anything. I think I just take the Team Pendant. And we'll see. This could be a team pendant deck, I don't know. Like, we had to get, like, a lot of tokens. Gems, who just take the culmination of studies, yeah. 
I'll take the team pendant with snakeskin veil. What? So the answer was, um... The answer was actually Silver Quill, because there's a Silver Quill command, but I'll take a Snakeskin Veil. Yeah. Awkward. I don't think this is insane. Like, I think it's just good or whatever. Like, the commands are, like, good. I don't think they're, like, broken. They're not, like, cryptic or anything level. Doesn't my creature count at 6? We can get creatures. Yeah. I kind of like negate. I also don't mind like a. I don't mind like a single negate in these type of decks. I like negate more than test of talent because there is like a fringe situation where you might want to counter like an artifact. Like a. I don't know. I don't think I want the life gain trick. Somebody got something really insane. Yeah, I'll take the oh field trip number two. That's true, they are creatures. Oh, field trip number two. It does counter planeswalkers, yeah. I think I need field trip number two. Field trip number two seems real good. I don't actually hate Cogwork Archivist just as like a big thing. I don't know. I, I don't think charge through is that great. I guess it's funny on the... It's funny on the body of research, but I don't know. Maybe. Okay, I think I'll take the Vortex Runner now, just because it is like kind of a late game win con. I don't hate the Test of Talons either, but I already have Negate. I don't think I need another one. Vortex Runner. Another Vortex Runner, like a Curate. I kind of want a card draw spell, but I don't really want Curate. I don't know, it's weird. I like Curate with Serpentine Curve. It's kind of cool. Like, you play Curate with Serpentine Curve, because like it put you can put stuff into your graveyard. It makes Serpentine Curve better. Like, we haven't seen like a lot of Serpentine Curve. Like sometimes in these drafts you can get like three or four Serpentine Curves, but so far not really. It's kind of weird. Kind of weird. But it's all good. You love the Curator Curve cards, yeah. Okay, we don't Curate anyways. I might actually play it. I don't know. Maybe. Alright, one more pack to go. Oh! Wow, this pack is insane. Apprentice, Barium Book, Sciences. But this is cards insane in this deck, right? Just take the Apprentice, because that card's really good. We are way mid range EU. Yeah. Maybe we'll take the Apprentice. Mythic Uncommon, yeah. Empathic sciences feel bad. Uh, I can't splash that, can I? I mean, Frost Rage would be fine, but... Is this a try to attempt to splash Rufa deck? Just take the Trickster, because it's on theme, yeah. Uh, I guess, like, the adult choice is take Trickster and just let that go. Adult choice is take the Trickster. We don't have any fixing. Oh, we got rewarded with a 3-3! We're an 8 No, wait! What? God damn it. It just won, like, the entire pack. Really? Denial, Cultivator, Mage Duel, Pugilist. What the? Oh, that's so gross. Can I just take this entire pack and then not draft anymore? But man, it sucks. Yeah, no, the rare is really good. But man, the thing that sucks about this is like, I, I've played this card before and then my opponent played like Eliminate on it because it's still a, it's still a three drop. They can eliminate it. 
That's such a meme. I think I'm supposed to say Barry, or the Summoning, or the Pledge Mage. I think I just want to take the Barry. Is that crazy? I don't think that card's that good. I think it's just the Barry, or the Pledge Mage. We could exponential or body of research because it doesn't it doesn't gain trample though they just chump it I don't know is either the berry or the pledge mage I'm thinking God this sucks I really want the berry I don't know I'm gonna take the berry sucks oh Kelpie guy no mage duel no. Hey there, Beyond Elite Tain, how's it going? I take the Kelpie Guide, though. Kelpie Guide's pretty insane. Right? No 90 creatures, and there's a cram, you know? I think it's between Mage Duel or Kelpie Guide. The Kelpie Guide seems actually kind of insane. It's like, it's an Icy Manipulator. It's just Icy Manipulator. I do need creatures, yeah, that's fair. Way too many playables, yeah. Ooh, we could do both. Or just take the Mage Duel. I want the Mentor's Guidance, but I feel like I need the Mage Duel. Because I just need, like, the interaction to, like, not die to stuff. Is that crazy? Guidance or Mage Duel? So close. If I had, like, the, um, Pledge Mage, I think I'd take the Guidance. I'm gonna take the mage duel. What's real? Another god? What? Uh oh no! Seriously? They're making me choose between these two cards. I can't do it. I can't do it. And also the Eureka moment. What? I can't do it. Why? Is this a cultivator? Okay, that's like the cultivator. Cultivator is actually pretty good. Blocking. Cultivate. Oh, hell yeah. I mean, there's a 1-3, but I'll take the Cultivate. Ramp. Ramps me. There's a 2-2 two -two that ramps. 2-2, two -two, two -two, that's a 4-4 four -four for 2 in this deck, actually. Um, I don't really want any of this. Bad. I might play a 3-2. I'm not gonna play a second team pendant, that seems bad. I, I might play a 3-2, but not really. I already have, like... I'm not gonna play Square Up, it's also kind of bad. Oh, the Decisive Wield! Yeah! That Wield. Hell yeah. Oh, the Exponential Grow Wield! I can... Meme, I guess. It, it's probably... Mm, I'm not gonna play anything here. Maybe, like, the Scry Land, whatever, just take it. Just memes. Memes! Meme! Okay. Oh, wow, this deck is really gross. Incoming 1-3. Oh, yeah. Incoming 1-3. Uh, Alright, let's do the stream raiders. Because people were waiting for a while on that. I'm, like, deciding what I want to do with the stream, stream raiders. i give you level 1 haste. Because why not? Let's go! Yeah, two duck. If you're a fan of two duck cube, you should be watching a lot of two duck cube for the top three rogues, and they're nice. We got two duck cubed. He's always posting all this information about drafts on uh, Twitter and stuff. Oh, I need to actually start the battle. It's not just enough to play, you also need to actually. You, you, it's not just enough to cast a spell, you need, you need to actually, like, Activate the thing, right? It's so good to see all these magic streamers. I know they're like doing well right now. Like, Papa Taco has like over 10 viewers now. Stuff. Air Bubbles cosplay has like 20 viewers. I don't know. But yeah. Big thanks to uh, Super Sessors for the raid. Um, let's go and. Coco Tricono for the follow, Sudanin for the follow, Bloblor for the follow. 100 pants for a huge raid, like almost 300 people. 
Here's Ferrets with a raid also, Xandor 42 with a raid, uh, MTG Girl with a follow. Yeah. Alright, most kill a jank shank, most is Jack the Broken. Alright, where's Paul though? Alright, we're gonna end the stream raiders. Kill the boss. Hey, thanks for the follow, Cyberwish. I appreciate it. But uh, if you wanna watch how uh, this happened, how this stream happened, or the draft happened, we'll be back Friday. I gotta work tomorrow and stuff. I mean, I'll be probably working after this, but, um... Yeah, thanks for, thanks for like, hanging out in the chat, by the way, Cyber Witch. But yeah, we'll go back to doing cuts and stuff. This deck is actually so good. I don't even want to think about doing the cuts. It's kind of insane. This is good. Hey, thank you very much for saying that, Todd Jordan. Appreciate it. Hope you enjoy the draft stream that you go to. I don't know. Who's going to raid now? I don't know. Who? Who that? I guess. The raid. Are we still going? No, I think I'm gonna go. Actually, I'm a little tired. Cause I'm a little like it's. I've been here for like over six hours. Stuff. So we'll catch up on this later.